Now, your KSBW weather forecast with Chief Meteorologist Lee Solomon. Good evening, everybody. Beautiful day. We'll check the view right now. Real nice. You can see the marine layer uh, back in the distance there. It's been working its way towards parts of the coast through most of the day and some folks enjoying uh, the evening here on Sunday. Again, a really nice day with temperatures really mild or just darn right warm, even a little toasty uh, in some spots. Look at the highs today. Middle 70s in Monterey, middle 80s in Santa Cruz, upper 80s in Gilroy and low 80s uh, down in King City, 78 today in San Jose and Santa Cruz Mountains checking in with an 87 in Ben Lomond. So the warmth was there and so were the low clouds. Again, Moss Landing over to Aptos. Uh, there was uh, some low cloud and fog and all of that was kind of happening. But up in Santa Cruz, uh, clear skies. Now, of course, it is starting to change a little bit as the marine layer is starting to make a little bit more of a push, although it hasn't certainly pushed inland yet. The other thing that's really interesting, you know, this time of year, we don't talk about cold fronts that often, but yes, we've had this front that's kind of been lined up from about Crescent City all the way up to Seattle. Crescent City, by the way, in the last couple of days, over two inches of rain. So that's a pretty good soaking up near the Klamath River and all of that. So, hey, we'll take the rain any way we can get it. And if they're getting it up in Oregon and Washington, which they are, that reduces their fire danger and, of course, kind of holds things off a little bit because their fires tend to produce a lot of smoke for us in the fall. Uh, interesting day tomorrow, 80s in Sacramento, 90s in Fresno. But look at this. This is what's going to be heading our way. I hate to say it, 113 in Palm Springs tomorrow. Some of that will work its way northward Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And that means our temperatures will really uh, be headed upwards, at least away from the coast. Of course, the marine layer uh, will do its job. Mother Nature's air conditioning will probably stay with us through the week. The low clouds will be there for you in the morning. Could be a little bit of patchy mist and, of course, some fog with that. We'll get a clearing tomorrow afternoon. It'll be later in the afternoon. And that stiff northwesterly breeze will come in at about 10 to 20, 25 miles an hour. So it'll be a windy afternoon, but it'll start getting that clearing going. Mid-50s to upper 50s overnight. The nights have become more mild. The bay temperatures have come up there, about 57 degrees now. And coast and Salinas, 62 to 74 tomorrow. Uh, they'll be a little cooler, of course, with the marine layer around in 70s and low 80s for the inland valleys with that wind in the afternoon. Here's a look at your highs tomorrow. 67 in San Francisco, 75 in San Jose. Los Gatos at about 80. And upper 70s, low 80s, Santa Cruz Mountains, middle 70s in Santa Cruz. And we've got that range from low to mid-60s in Moss Landing to middle 70s in Coralitas, low 80s in Gilroy, 79 in Hollister, 75 in San Juan Batista. Nice day in the Salinas Valley. Low 70s Salinas, upper 70s Greenfield, low 80s King City, and a little warmer southward towards Parkfield, Bradley, Lake Nascimento. 68 in Monterey tomorrow, 74 in Carmel Valley. So cooler conditions along the coast. And we're kind of going to stay that way. Coast will eventually warm up a little bit. 60s and 70s Tuesday, Wednesday. We'll see some middle 70s to low 80s by the bay. But watch what happens to the inland valleys starting on Tuesday, but really cranking up Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Middle 80s to middle and upper 90s, Chris. So we could have some heat advisories by the time we get to Wednesday. That's something we're watching. And, of course, that will elevate fire danger somewhat. Of right. course, inland, we'll be watching the winds. So far, I don't think we'll see a red flag warning. But be prepared, some heat is on the way. Okay, good warning. Summer's here. Yes, it is. Yeah. Thanks, Lee.